They sure picked the right person for that job. Listen, it's gonna be great here. I thought San Francisco was my chance to start fresh. I was the hot shit, the gunslinger from the hub, rolling into town with the world at my feet. How'd this dude make it all the way out to the I was East the Coast? One shot Valdez. I could write my own ticket to any outfit in town. It all worked out pretty damn well. For a while. See this? This is what's gonna keep you and Mary safe. I promise. I know, Connie. I'm sure we're gonna be really happy here. We are. You'll see. That's okay. I got her. Let's keep looking. I'll connect you to the <laughs> next intact memory. Alright, this one tells me this next one's gonna be fucked up. How did you think this was gonna end, Kellogg? <laughs> you thought you could just fuck with us, and we wouldn't fuck with you? Just so you know, they died like dogs. And you weren't there to help them. I found another memory to try. I'll connect it. Well, so somebody killed his crew? Like double crossed him or something? It's pretty fucking trippy. Mind if we sit down? Suit yourself. There's always someone who wanted someone else dead. Sometimes just roughed up, but uh, dead was usually what they wanted. Sometimes they thought they could cheat me. That was usually only when I first arrived somewhere. Didn't matter to me. They just took it as part of the job. A little extra thrown in for free. I always got paid in the end. One way or another. So, there was always a job for someone like me. Um, I hear you'll take care of people's problems. Is that right? If you pay me. Oh, we'll pay you. And uh, you'll do this all by yourself? That's right. We pay. I didn't care where I was going. Mm. Ended up mostly wandering east. Getting as far away from San Francisco as I could, maybe. Job's done. Is that okay? That's the way you want to do it? So who do you want dead? Well, it's like this. There's his family. Lives down the creek a ways. Well, we seem to be getting closer. Try this next one. Okay. <laughs> Killing a whole family? Hmm. Yeah, this dude is fucked up. Mr. Keller, I'm glad you decided to meet with me. So, you're with the Institute. I wanted to see for myself if you really existed. We do, as you can see. What do you want? It's come to... The first synths weren't all that impressive. I'm good, but I'm not that good. But the Institute could always make more, and kept making them better each time. They still give me the creeps, but you have to get used to them if you want to work with the Institute. My attention that you've been... You heard all sorts of rumors about the Institute. But I figured they were just a convenient boogeyman for anything bad that ever happened. They were real, all right. They didn't know anything about operating on the surface. Relied on their synths for everything. They had the resources I needed. And I had the expertise they needed. Turned into a permanent arrangement. Suited me just fine. 
I finally ended up in the Commonwealth. I kind of ran out of road. Plus, weird ass memories. I come to terms with life. I wasn't going to be stupid enough to get mixed up with caring about other people again. It was just me against the world. And the world had it coming. Of our operations lately. This must stop. I do what people pay me to do. If that's a problem for you, I can see only one way out. And what's that, Mr. Kellogg? If I'm working for you, there's no more problem. From what I hear, you can afford me. I don't think you fully understand the situation you're in. I think I do. Very well. B-748, initiate. <laughs> Okay. Hmm. Impressive. We may have something to talk about after all. Getting warmer. One of these has got to tell us something. We are running out of brain here. Ah. Ah, there's one that looks mostly intact. Connecting now. Okay. Manual override initiated. Oh shit. The eggheads never liked taking orders from a dirty, contaminated degenerate like me. But they needed me, and I made sure they knew it. All computers are still working. I was now the Institute's main operator in the Commonwealth. If they needed something done, they came to me. It wasn't usual for anybody from the Institute to come along on a mission, so... This one stood out. I didn't know then who it was we were grabbing from the vault. Of course, neither did they. Not really. That's good. Check it. I never knew why we didn't just refreeze the rest of them. But we had our orders. <laughs> I guess the old man didn't want so many loose ends. Too bad he left alive the one person he shouldn't have. Hopefully it's all just find it. Pod C6. Down the hall near the end. I never knew why we didn't just refreeze the rest of them. Even then, I knew it was a mistake leaving him alive. I understood <laughs> that kind of revenge. No one better. But I was cocky enough to assume I could handle some soft, pre-war vault dweller. Even if he somehow got thawed out. At least I know those Institute bastards will soon get what's coming to them, too. If he could take me out... They won't be able to hide from him for long. I'm glad I didn't have to kill the kid. I'm not saying I haven't done it, but uh, yeah. I never liked to. And yeah, I guess it did remind me of uh, her. Yeah, I'm a cold-hearted bastard for sure, but uh, I'm still human. Better this way, though. Better than taking her kid and leaving her alive. This is the one. Here. Jeez. Open it. Is it over? Are we okay? Almost. Everything's going to be fine. Come here. Come oh, here, wait. baby. No, no. I've got him. Let the boy go. I'm only gonna tell you once. I'm not giving you Sean! Fuck. God damn it. 
knows now the Institute's maybe. Get the kid out of here and let's go. At least we still have the backup. Cryogenic sequence reinitialized. What's the holdup? I'm almost finished, Kellogg. I just need to confirm. All right, we're good. I'm, uh, I'm sorry you had to go through that again. Ah, oh, jeez. I found another intact memory. Whenever you're ready. Okay, so... Is that your son? This appears to be a very recent memory. So, good news, I think. This whole setup in Diamond City was part of some elaborate plan of the old man's. Who's this old man? Seems obvious now that we were bait for our friend from the vault. Timing couldn't have been an accident. It's not how the old man works. I wonder if he outsmarted me in the end. Another loose end tied up. Mm. It wasn't my idea to settle down with the kid in the middle of Diamond City. <laughs> I thought it was a terrible idea, actually. But it was one of the old man's pet projects, so here we were. Me and the kid. Like a happy little family. I ended up kind of liking it. <laughs> a reminder of what my life might have been if things had turned out <sighs> differently. But there's no going back. I knew it was just temporary. It'd be back to normal business before too long. Kellogg. It's okay. One of these days you're gonna get your head the new breed of synths could easily pass as human. Some of them did. But the Coursers, they weren't built to blend in. They were killing machines, pure and simple. Smarter, stronger, and faster than almost any real human. I'm just glad they were always on my side. Minimizing my exposure to civilians is a priority. Forget I said anything. So what's the big crisis this time? New orders for you. One of our scientists has left the Institute. Left? Mm. As in? He's gone rogue. Name's Dr. Brian Virgil. We know he's hiding somewhere in the glowing sea. Here's his file. are gonna roll for this capture and return or just elimination elimination <laughs> he was working on a highly classified program no kitty kidding. don't don't sit on that one of the top bioscience boys damn <laughs> so I guess you're taking the kid back with you affirmative your only mission is to locate and eliminate Virgil you're taking me home to my father Yes. Stand next to me and hold still. Okay. Okay. What the fuck are they doing? X688. Ready to relay with Sean. Bye, Mr. Kellogg. I hope I see you again soon. <laughs> Uh, like a teleporter? Teleportation. Now it all makes sense. Nobody's found the entrance to the Institute because there is no entrance. Let me pull you out of there as soon as you're ready. Right. <laughs> Jeez. Teleportation, really? <laughs> 